Holy crap, it's a crapple. I mean, holy crap, it's loot crate. This actually came rather quickly. Not as quick as the first loot crate I got, but it came pretty quickly. I was expecting this in about five days or so. Nope, it came today. Anyway, loot crate, let's not waste any more time. The theme is play. And, oh. It's a board game. The box is a board game. Crate Packing Simulator 2015. But right now, we want to see what's in the box, and immediately I see this. This would be... Money World Mini Money. Money? Create your own vinyl art toy. Includes three wipe-off markers. Design, admire, and inspire. I am turning off autofocus because this is annoying me! Design, admire, and inspire. Create your own art toy. You can make whatever the hell that is. Money world. You can draw on money. You can paint on money. Use pens, pencils, and crayons on money. Make things to put in money's hands. Make has to put on money's hand. Or you can just leave money alone and keep money next to you for company. I will probably do that because I don't have friends. That's a lie. I have plenty of friends. Anyway, for more information, visit kidrobot slash money... Bleh, kidrobot.com slash money world. Wipeout markers. Okay, that's actually kind of pretty cute. I'm in a rush because I'm going to go eat food right now. And also, I have school. And I just found out that the bottom is actually already open. Kids robots. I also said kids robot because you know I'm kind of stupid. Uh, I guess I can open it. And yeah, look at that. Markers right here. You guys, it even focus correctly. Sure, why not? And the thing right here, I am not gonna look to. I just dropped the markers. Oh no. Oh well, I'll get them later. No, I'm gonna get them right now because if I don't get them right now, I will forget that I have them. Anyway, let me put these back and put this. You know what? I don't even have a second camera, so I should probably do this on screen. A derp, a derp, a derp, derpy, derpy, derpity, derp, derpy, derpy, derpity, derp, but derp, a derp, but derp, a derp. Next, we've got hex bug. I have never owned a hex bug before. I think it's one of those things that you wind up and it does stuff it jumps or something yep hex bug looks like kind of a scorpion i'm gonna look at it with my own eyes yeah it's just a scorpion i don't really know how these work to be honest not a scorpion more like a frog i don't know then we go on to a bag i always wanted a bag and inside are Dice! Huh. Let me look at these with my eyes. Yeah, these are like pixelated dice. I don't really know if these are meant to be stylized after anything. The bag doesn't have anything on them, but they're dice. And that's what counts in the end. Dice. And next in the box is Super Fight the Loot Crate Debt from Sky... Skybound Games. Skybound Games. This is a 100 card version of viral card game Super Fight designed exclusively for Loot Crate by Skybound. These cards are only available in this exclusive deck. Create hilarious fires with these cards and then argue over who would win in a fight between them. Superfightgame.com, Skybound.com. I will keep wanting to say Skyhound because, you know, I'm kind of stupid. Uh... Cool. I am not going to open these right now simply because I don't have time and also the battery on my camera is going to die. So let's look at this stick. It's cardboard. Oh, I see. It's a poster. Uh, uh, give me a moment. I'm putting this off camera so I can open it. There we go. Yeah, cannot get it out. There we go. Holy crap, that's Pac-Man. It is the anatomy of a Pac-Man Atari 2600 card. Except this is a complete lie. This is the arcade version of Pac-Man. This is the Atari 2600 crap version. I got a lie. Yeah. I'm sorry. I cannot tell a lie because I actually liked the Atari 2600 version of Pac-Man. I do not... Well, I do understand why it kind of, why it kind of flopped, but still, I had a good time with it, and I guess people in 1981 are just picky. 
Did I just say 1981? It was 1983. Video game crash of 83 and 84. I cannot get this back in the plastic. We will worry about this later then. And this. Ready Player One. Ernest Klein. New York Times. Oh, it's a book. Wow, I got a biography. Okay, maybe it's not a biography. Maybe it's just a novel, but let's read the back. In the year 2044, yeah, it's a novel. Ernest Klein. Let me read this. In the year 2044, reality is an ugly place. The only time teenage Wade Watts really feels alive is when he's jacked into the world of the virtual utopia known as the Oasis. Wade's devoted his bleh, Wade's devoted his life to studying the puzzles hidden within this world's digital confines. Puzzles that are based on their creator's obsession with the pop culture of decades past and that promise massive power and fortune to whoever can unlock them. But then Wade stumbles upon the first clue. He finds himself beset by players willing to kill to take his ultimate prize. The race is on, and if Wade's going to survive, he'll have to win. And to confront the real world, he's always been so desperate to escape. I will probably read this eventually, I hope. I have a bad tendency of not reading. And Firefly, Buddhist Temple, Buddhist Temple concept art. You know, I hear about Firefly so often, and quite frankly, I never knew what it was, so now I got something of Firefly. And... Loot Crate, official member. What is this? Just a card. I am apparently that number. Looter number 256455. Okay. And this little piece of paper is Crate Packing Simulator 2015 Game Instructions. Welcome to Loot Crate's first original board game. The goal is simple. Be the first player to have all five items in your crate. T-shirt, which there isn't one in this box. Thanks for the irony. 8-bit glasses. That was last year's box. Last year's box, last month's box. Funko, I guess this is the substitute for Funko. Is this made by Funko? No, it's made by money. A poster, which I got, and a button. Here it is, button. Let me look at that one in my eyes. Cute, actually kind of cute button. Use the rock, paper, scissors, dice. Oh. Okay, that's what it is. I just thought it was like the hand symbols for numbers, you know. Zero, one, two, three, four, five. Actually, this is three. This is actually six, believe it or not. Uh, land on a star, pick up an item. You know what? I am going to demonstrate this eventually once I actually get to play friends. Let me rephrase that. Once I actually get to play with friends. And I got a card. I, I, I enjoy cards. I dropped the instructions. No. And, of course, play... Co-op gaming, history of game controllers. Huh. Oh. Here are the little figurinos. Cool. Uh. And I just turn to the epic mega crate. You get a 3D printer in the mega crate. And you get an Oculus Rift in the mega crate. Why can't I win the mega crate? I want a 3D printer. I got a paper glass. I would just sell the Oculus Rift. I have no interest in it. Anyway, that's the loot crate. The box is a board game. I'm not going to assemble it right now. I will just edit that into post later. Because by the time you're actually watching this, it'll probably be in a couple of weeks. You know, I'm late like that. Also, I'll decide later whether I actually want to continue getting these loot crates or not. I wanted to base it off of this box, and I'm going to decide later if I like it. So, yeah.
Body modifications is the topic for today. What do I think of them? Do I think that they're appropriate? What not, so on, so on, so on. So tattoos and piercings, you know the whole thing. 